The vegetarians of the animal world, or herbivores as they are more commonly known, tend to be primarily grazers and browsers. Due to their eating habits, large herbivores like elephant and herds of grazers like zebra have a huge impact on the environment. The black rhino, for example, has a pointed upper lip, useful for plucking leaves and fruit from branches and eating longer grasses. On the other hand, white rhino are square-lipped, eating like lawnmowers and preferring shorter grass. On our way back to camp, we've bumped into this big, big guy, a lovely white rhino. Um, and sees a white rhino by the shape of the back, as well as the uh, shape of the mouth. Unfussy eaters like zebra that eat a wide variety of different grasses are considered to be pioneer grazers, preparing plains for more specialized grazers who rely on short nutritional grasses. It's another nice big herd of zebra, quite nicely spread out. If you look at the tummy of this one furthest behind us, you'll see it's quite big. Uh, that's not an indication that he's well fed and fat. Uh, zebra are known as uh, hind gut fermenters. So what that generally, what that means is that they eat in bulk. They eat in bulk and uh, they don't digest a huge amount of what they eat. Herbivores also help balance ecosystems by opening trails and creating space for other smaller animals to move around. They can influence the spread of species, with seeds being distributed in their dung along migration routes, so helping to improve the diversity of flora. Successful translocations of zebra and wildebeest this year have helped to rebuild struggling ecosystems. As systems rejuvenate, it is more able to sustain both human and animal life.